Hello and welcome to Girl Saver Screen. If it is your first time here, hello again. If you are returning, welcome back. Last episode, we were introduced to Obi-Wan's current state, him dealing with all of the things that has happened to him. We met the Inquisitors and the kids and Leia was kidnapped and Obi-Wan is gonna go look for her. So let's get into this episode. What planet is this? Spare any credits. Help a veteran get a war. Is that a stormtrooper? Who are you? Or what are you? I don't know. Clone War? I don't know. I'm looking for my daughter, but she was taken when she's on this planet. Well, if she's here, you're never gonna see her again. Nobody leaves this place. You having trouble? There's a Jedi. He helps people. I'll take you to him for the right price. It's okay, you're safe now. That voice sounds familiar to me. Who is it? <laughs> hey, I knew it. Passenger check eight three C. Do you read? Over. Is that a trick or is he actually a Jedi? I'm sending a mother and son to your gate. You will let them through when they arrive. I'll let them through when they arrive. I feel like he's tricking them. I don't trust I'm him. I'm not leaving. You're mine. <sighs> he's a liar. He's a trickster, you dick. The force is so strong with you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> what a dick. Thank you for helping us, Haja. Oh, the Jedi must protect their own. With your son's abilities, they will come for oh, him. Oh no, I hope he's not like selling these children to the bounty hunters, to the Inquisitors. I don't want the kids to get hurt. I'm looking for a Jedi. How'd you get in here? A girl has been kidnapped. I need your help to find her. I am Haja Estri, Jedi. The shadows are my realm for the light. It's an unforgiving place for my kind. Of course. How much? He's so dramatic. What a dick. <laughs> what do you know of the Force, my friend? Just that there's a lot of remotes and magnets. It looks like you just took money from that family. I got them safe, just a little poorer. You're gonna help me find this girl I'm looking for? Yeah, I'll do it. Oh no. How did they not notice that it was you? Hey. What are you doing back here? Oh, I seem to have lost my way. I know the alien with the spikes. I just don't remember their names. Where's the girl? You still have some good fight in you left, sir. Even though <laughs> you're old, you still got some good fight left in you. It's a trick. I figured you'd be smarter than to risk everything for a spoiled little. <laughs> You're not a Jedi anymore, Kenobi. You're just a man. Nice. Smart. Sir, I need you to hurry up. I need you to move faster. I know you're not going to die, but you might get hurt. Wait. Let go of me. Wait. Let go. I like Leia. She is so feisty and so adorable. Your father sent me. I'm here to help you. Where's the army? Smart girl. Most people would just go with them. But she's like, why should I trust you? Like, do I know you? You might be another creep. Keep your head down. No, oh, no. She's like in here somewhere. <laughs> Are they drugged? Are they high? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Where is he? 
You would kidnap an Imperial Senator's child? Whatever power you are craving, it will not change what you are. What is she? Why is she the least? You came to us from the gutter. Your ability gave you station, but all the power in the world can't mask the stench. What gutter did she come from? Like, what's the beef? Secure the city. I will take Kenobi in myself. You will be dealt with when we return. There is so much hostility and I don't know why. She is like acting irrationally when it comes to like to the group. I want every lowlife and bounty hunter on this planet to know Kenobi is here. Why is she so mad at him? Like it has to be personal. If it's not, then she's just crazy. Why aren't you using your lightsaber? I read that Jedi can make things float. Make me float. What? I want to float. We had him. Look at this reward. He'll have half of the city on him now. Let's get to him first. Who was? There's a bounty hunter. What is that? Why is there a picture of you? Did my father even see you? Of course he did. Leia, listen. How do I know you're not the real kidnapper? You have to... Leia! Girl, no. you're being dumb. Okay, I know you're a child, but you're kind of being stupid. Where are you gonna go, child? Just tell us where it is. Great. Now he's in danger. God, this dumb girl. We're screwed. She heard it. She's gonna go kill you. I'm irritated. I'm kind of mad. Leia, Leia, no! No! Oh my god. She's not gonna die. Woo. Who are you? Oh, thank god. The entire city's locked down. Cargo port, it's fully automated. They won't be looking for you there. Shall we trust you though? I'm trying to make amends. I got that family safe and I'm gonna do the same for you. Are you on our side though? I want you to be, but I will hate it if you betrayed us. Finally we meet. I am Haja Estri, Jedi. Oh no, I don't want you to die. Get out of my way. What's the bounty on me now? Doesn't matter because you will not get it. <laughs> the eyes, the eyebrows. I love him. <gasps> Where is he? Ah, that wasn't Magnus, was it? I'm not gonna answer it. I don't need you to. She can read your mind, or she can make you tell her. We must be careful. Since I met you, I've been chased, shot at, I almost fell to my death, and now there are inquisiting people after us. If somebody is offering us help, I think we should take it. Now come on. Then you just remind me of someone. She died a long time ago. I'm sorry. There. If I don't get back in time, go. I'll be right behind you, I promise. This is very intense right now. You don't have to worry. You're not going to die. So she doesn't want to kill him herself? To take you to me. 
Lord Vader will be pleased. You didn't know. <gasps> oh, Anakin is Vader. Okay. Makes much more sense. He's alive, Obi-Wan. Did Anakin task her to find Obi-Wan? Is that why she's going so hard? And it will make sense why she hasn't gotten in trouble. Her sister! I can stand the reek of your ambition no longer. I found him. We have him. And I cannot risk you losing him again. I already don't like him. <gasps> what? She's killed him? Who's in the gutter now? She is crazy. She a crazy one. She is crazy. What's wrong with you, girl? I mean, I get why she did it. But at the same time, can you just be out here doing whatever you want? Your student is alive. He is alive. And he's gonna ruin the galaxy. Ooh, you don't look good, Vader. So are we gonna see more of Dark Vader? Are we gonna see everything that um, Star Wars didn't cover? Is this what the shows are about? Okay, so that was part two of Obi-Wan Kenobi. This was another good episode. I loved seeing Obi-Wan and Leia's banter. They're funny together. Leia kind of annoyed me this episode because she was being kind of dumb, but she's a child. <laughs> And she doesn't know Obi-Wan or his motive of being there. So it's understandable that she was acting the way that she was. And she's a sensible kid, so that's understandable. It was really cool to see Obi-Wan use the Force to save her. And it gave me all of the feels. I'm not into Star Wars like that, but it was amazing to see him use the Force and just let her down gently. That was really cool to see. And Obi-Wan found out that Anakin was alive this episode and the actor was so good because you can see all of the feeling on his face like I could not imagine what he was going through in that moment it would be crazy and you can see it on his face all I can think is are they gonna meet how is it gonna go like what is Obi-Wan gonna do because that would be crazy you thought you killed this person and he's alive and he's probably pissed at you so I'm excited to see what's gonna happen with all of that when it comes to Reva and the Inquisitors. Reva is intense. <laughs> like she is hot blooded and she straight up killed the Grand Inquisitor like it was nobody's business. And I'm like, are they going to find out that she killed him and what's going to happen to her? Because I kind of like her. <laughs> She's very intense. Obviously, she has issues with the other Inquisitors. They were talking about that she came from the gutter. I am ready for her backstory. Like I want flashbacks. And then when it comes to her beef with Obi-Wan, it has to be personal. Even if she wants to be be like the Grand Inquisitor. She wants power. Her anger and hate towards Obi-Wan is too intense for just a job. Like it has to be something personal. I wonder if like she's one of those kids that we saw in the beginning. Either that or her parents died because of Obi-Wan. It has to be something personal to her. I hope we get like flashbacks soon of what happened to her, how she came to become an Inquisitor and all of that. And the Grand Inquisitor said that her powers gave her station. So she has to have like strong force powers. So I want to know what happened between her being a child and being where she's at right now. And I wonder if she's being so reckless with how she's like being with the other Inquisitors because Anakin asked her to find Obi-Wan. Because I'm assuming there has to be some kind of chain of command in the Empire and the Grand Inquisitor is like the one in charge but she's being all over the place <laughs> she is being reckless and rude to everybody so she has to have someone backing her in order to be acting that way so i wonder if anakin asked her be like find obi-wan for me you were hurt by him just like i was hurt by him he's trash let's bond in our hatred <laughs> for Obi-Wan Kenobi. This was another good episode. This show isn't what I thought it was going to be or progress the way that I thought it would, but 
it's good so far i am enjoying it i think the visuals are beautiful especially when reva is pulling out her lightsaber it looks amazing and the sound design is so good <laughs> i was like this is some good sound design i'm enjoying the show so far and i'm looking forward to seeing the rest of the season Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then like and subscribe for more. And you might like one of these two videos. I hope you have a good one and you'll see me later. Bye.